Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Fishing with Flair. Today I have a very unique uh, review slash unboxing kind of deal going on here. Uh, right here I have uh, the it's an RC fishing boat. It's made by Fish Fu Fish Fun Company. Uh, you can get them at rcfishingworld.com. Uh, basically, what it is is an, a remote control boat um, that they have this little uh, attachment that you can uh, you can use to fish, and you can buy the attachment for twenty dollars. Um, and basically what it does is it has, you can see on the back there's some propellers and it runs on these batteries right here and you, you can open this up and there's two motors, it's dual propeller um, and you run it through this and you can see here all the different models they have, some really cool selections speed boats, this one is called the Radio Ranger um, this one retails for around eighty dollars on their website like I said you can buy that uh, fishing pole attachment for twenty dollars basically what you do is on here there's a little hole and you tie your line through there like you know tie a knot let the line go down tie your hook tie your bobber whatever it comes with this pack it comes with a bobber some line um, and you basically let it sit there and once the fish pulls down the bobber or whatever lure you're using you you basically gun it you gun the boat and you go and you basically set the hook with the boat and then you bring the boat back to you to catch the fish it's a lot of fun um here are some velcro patches that you can stick on top of this in case you're fishing for bass a lot like i would um instead of tying your line to here because although this is a very powerful boat I'm not sure if you had a three, four pound largemouth that it'd be able to withstand it. You know, I don't, you don't want to submerge the boat or anything like that. Um, so what you can do is you stick the Velcro on there and you basically embed your line in the Velcro and you can run the boat out to wherever you want. And as soon as the fish bites it, you set the hook with your fishing pole and the line will come off of the Velcro. Basically it just transports your line. Um, but any, otherwise, if you're fishing for bluegill, some crappie, some smaller one to two pound bass, um, in ponds and lakes, um, this should work for you just uh, just fine. This is a little stand it comes with that you can put together, and it also comes with, um, like I said, it comes with one battery. They also sent me they sent me an extra battery with a smart charger. Smart charger uh, you can get for uh, twenty five dollars on their website. It basically tells you when it's done, versus uh, this one. This one, if you let it run for days and days, it'll burn up your battery, sometimes catch on fire and that kind of stuff. This one tells you when it's done. It has trickle charge. Um, comes with a couple extra propellers in case you bust them off. This is a cool little feature. Um, it lights up, and you can clip it on to this. So when the fish bites, it has rattles and a light in case you're fishing at night. Um, comes with a diff couple different connectors with the smart charger. They also sent me a Y connector. This uh, Y connector will allow me to connect two two batteries together into this boat, so you can run. Each battery will run for about 20 minutes per charge, um, and this is not made for racing. It's made for basically driving out to the middle of the lake or wherever, and uh, once you catch a fish, set the hook and bring it in, you know, reel the fish in with the boat, and that's about it. It's not made for racing. You can kind of burn up the batteries, but they also do make a bunch of different uh, boats that uh, you'll be able to use if you want to race with them. So I'll take this off and I'll show you the insides here. So you can see there's two motors um, and then how you set it up is you'll stick the battery in there and it places in there very snug like that See, it's not going to go anywhere and you plug it in and like I said you can run two batteries at once that way you can get about an hour of uh, time and that's that's a continuous time. It's not like a half an hour just dead sitting. Um, then you have this. This runs on, I believe, eight batteries. Um, you turn it on. It has lights here, and then you can see the propeller. So it's kind of loud. Um, you squeeze the trigger. You squeeze the trigger over here um, to make it go forward, and you turn this wheel to make it turn. There's no reverse on it, but you can listen. See, so yeah, it's very, it's a very powerful boat. I already took it out once before. I wanted to kind of make this review and talk about it just so I kind of knew um, what. Uh, what I can tell you guys what to expect. It does go very fast and go up to 20 miles per hour, which is really, really cool. And like I said, um, awesome that you can incorporate fishing with it. I've always wanted one of these. I used to have a little one that I would race around when I was a little kid. I've always uh, loved these. And uh, as soon as I saw uh, incorporate fishing, I knew that I had to have one. It's a really cool product. You guys should definitely check it out. Um, like I said, you can go to, go to rcfishingworld.com. Um, I'll put it the link in the description. And it's made by Fish Fun Company. That's the name of it, and like I said, there's plenty of 
different boats for you to choose from. They sent a bunch of decals like this. You can you can completely customize the boat. Um, you can even take spray paint or Sharpie and you know design it yourself. Put your YouTube name on it or whatever. Make it really cool with a bunch of different colors. So this is an awesome product you guys should definitely check out. I also got a shirt. You can see there. RC Fishing World is the remote control fishing pole. You see the front and the back there. Pretty cool there. So uh, definitely go check this out. Um, it's an awesome, awesome product that I'm sure a lot of you guys would like. Um, like I said, I took it out to the lake. What I'm planning on doing is mounting my GoPro on here, which is going to be really cool. I'm either mounting it here or when this is on top of here, I'm going to mount it on top of here. So I'll have it facing this so when the fish grabs it, I'll be able to film the whole thing. And then I'm also going to mount it up here or up here facing this way um, or off to the side. So if I'm fishing, you know, just taking my personal boat out, I can have it on next to me or trailing me or whatever and have a new cool perspective of a camera angle. Um, I can run this back up up against the bank if I'm throwing a buzz bait and I can cast right at it. I can make some really cool videos how to skip and I can show the lure skipping right up to the boat. could have some really cool camera angles. Um, that's also what this offers besides the whole fishing and uh, the fishing boat aspect of it is you can use it for camera angles which is what I plan mainly on doing but I'm also going to do a lot of catching fish some smaller bluegill when I go to different ponds and lakes it's a lot of fun uh, definitely go check them out they're on YouTube as well put that link in the description as well if you want to see um, how they work and stuff like that so hopefully I explained enough for you guys go check them out and thanks for watching